Hello, my name is Jonathan Harris from Worldwide Camera Exchange. Hasselblad filters and Hasselblad lens hoods can be a little bit confusing. Um, you buy Nikon lenses, you buy Sony lenses, you buy Leica lenses, they're a standard screw fitting. But uh, with Hasselblad, it's a bit different. So I thought I'd spend a few a few minutes just, just, just talking through the various sizes and explaining how they've changed over the years. Okay, first of all, the... Um, first C-type lenses, which were introduced uh, roughly 1957. This is, um, this is a Hasselblad C-type lens. Uh, they're available in black or in chrome. Later versions have the T-star coating. So if you see a lens described as C or C-T-star, it's basically this version. Uh, they're quite coarse and knurling. And if you, if you move the uh, shutter and aperture ring, you can see the little red depth of field markings move in and out. So this was the version available from 57 up to the late, uh, early 80s. These usually have a bayonet 50 fitting. So it's not, a, it's not a screw thread, it's a bayonet fitting for both the filter and the hood. This is a bayonet 50 filter, it's roughly 50 mil across. You'll see it, it, it bayonets onto the internal bayonet fitting on the lens. The external bayonet is for the hood. This is a, a this is a 50 a bay 50 hood. Um, just goes onto the external bayonet on the hood like that. So it's a fairly straightforward. This fitting, the bayonet 50 fitting, is available for the 80 mil standard, the 150 and the 250 mil lenses in the CT star type. Now, if you've got the C or CT star lens and it's the 50 mil or the, or the 60 mil, that takes something fairly unusual called a series 63 filter. Now this is a series 63 filter, happens to be exactly the same as the Leica series eight filter. So if you're looking for a filter for your 50 or 60 mil, then you can use the uh, Leica series eight or the Hasselblad series 63. The most notable thing about this, it doesn't have a thread. And this attaches to the lens using a retaining ring. So the filter drops into the retaining ring, the whole ring then screws onto the lens. If you're using a lens hood, this is a lens hood for a 50 mil CT star lens that the filter actually drops into the lens hood there. Then the whole thing screws onto the lens. So 50 mil and 60 mil, C and CT star type lenses, there are 63 fitting. Now, let's go down to the 40 mil. Fairly big lump. That's unusual, not many people have even seen these lenses, but if you want a filter for that, it's, it's a dedicated 104 millimeter bayonet filter. But that is a bit of an outlier, as is the 500 mil at the other end of the spectrum, that also needs its own filter. So that's the, um, that's the CT star lenses. Fundamentally 50 mil, bayonet 50 mil front, for the 80, 150, and 250. If you want a filter for your CT star uh, 50 mil or 60 mil, it's the unusual series 63 fitting. And if you happen to have the 40 mil or the um, the 500 mil at the two ends of the um, the spectrum, then they're dedicated filters. Okay, let's move on to CF lenses. This is a CF lens, um, much more modern looking. Doesn't have the uh, the moving uh, depth of field depth of field uh, marks, and is is it, they're generally a bayonet 60 fitting. So this is um. This is a bayonet 60 fitting. Again, same, sim similar system. Ba internal bayonet for the filters. This is, a, this is um, a hood that goes on the external bayonet like that. The hood is also referred to as the bayonet 60 hood. So unsurprisingly, these are about 60 mil across. Now, the 80 mil, the 100 mil, the 120 mil, the 150 mil, the 250 mil and the 50 mil wide angle all take this bayonet 60 front if the lens is a CF, CFI or CFE type. The only lenses in the Hasselblad CF range that don't have the bayonet 60 uh, front are the, the 40 mil, the 500 mil at the other end of the spectrum and the, the other odd, odd, odd little odd man out, odd lens out, is the Hasselblad 50 mil CFE, uh, yes, CFE lens. The Hasselblad CFE lens takes a bayonet 70 filter. So, just to summarize there, Hasselblad CF, 
newer style with the rubberized focusing and the non-moving depth of field scale, the vast majority of them do take the 60 millimeter filter. Um, the only ones that don't take the 60 millimeter filter are the 40 mil, the very last 50 mil, the CFE version, and the 500 mil. So I hope that's been useful. Um, if you have any comments, please stick them in the box below. Otherwise, please like and subscribe. And I hope to see you again soon. Thank you. Bye-bye.